Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Your girl Jensine, aka Jungle Naps, is back in the building. And today I'm here with a New Year's Eve makeup look. And this is a collaboration with my girl Marquita83 here on YouTube. We've been YouTube friends for a while now, so I'm really excited to be able to do this collaboration with her. Make sure you go ahead and stop by her channel. You know, you gotta support these smaller YouTubers. So please subscribe to her channel, give it a thumbs up after you finish watching this makeup look. And uh, yeah, let me know you guys. I got, I got a little glam for you guys, a little glam. But this gorgeous eye look is just something I'm so, so proud of. And it's actually pretty easy to create. So this is just going to be all about the eyes today. So you know what? Sit back, relax, get yourself a little bit of a snack. And if you guys recreate this look, please go ahead and tag me on Instagram or, you know, just go ahead and send me a quick snap on Snapchat. You can find all of my social media links up above. And uh, yeah, let's get to it. So I'm starting off using some tape. I couldn't find real tape, so I'm using masking tape here. And of course, you know what, you guys, we gotta prime our eyes. I have oily lids and I really want to make sure that this look doesn't transfer so I'm using my favorite one from Smashbox. And now I really want to go over that with a flesh colored uh, shade and I'm taking Bold from the Tartiste Pro palette and just patting it all over my eyelid. And then we want to go in with a transition color. So the first one I'm using is called Innocent from the same palette. And it's a super light orangey color. And it's actually really beautiful. And next up, I want to deepen that up with the color Whimsy. It's a darker orange shade, so I really just like how the two of those shades, Innocent and Whimsy, look, you know, when they're layered together. I think it looks really, really nice on deeper skin tones and makes the transition a little bit more gradual. And you really just want to blend, blend, blend here. So I'm using um, my blending brush from SL, Miss Glam, and I'm really making sure that I get, you know, nice, smooth transition colors. Now I'm using the MAC Paint Pot in the color Groundwork, and I'm essentially creating a cut crease shape. So I'm using like a flat concealer brush, and really making sure that I get a really nice coating on there. So right now it looks a little bit rough, but you'll see when I carve out that shape that it looks nice and smooth. So take your time with this, you know, you don't want to rush this look at all. And now I'm using a lip brush. It's like an angled lip brush, but I'm really using that to carve out the top line so it'll look nice and smooth. And now, oh my God, you guys, I'm in love with this shade. It's called um, Henna from NYX, and it is just the most beautiful light green shade, and I feel like it just goes with any skin color. And I'm just using a flat uh, shadow brush to go ahead and lightly, you wanna tap it in, but also like just be gentle because you don't want any fallout. And now I'm using that same angled lip brush to go ahead and smooth out uh, those transitions between the orange and the green. And now I'm using the color Punk from the same palette. And I'm adding that to the edge right where the tape, you know, meets my eyelid. And I want to create like a nice ombre graded effect. And I have to admit, you guys, so I used the ColourPop Liner and Swerve, and today was kind of like a struggle liner day. I just couldn't get it to be, you know, nice and smooth. In the end, you'll see, I made it work, but it was it a was struggle day today. <laughs> so I'm removing that tape nice and gently, and then I'm gonna go ahead and highlight my inner corners. 
I'm using the color Glam from the Tartiste Pro palette. And time for a little bit mascara. And then I added some false lashes to make this like extra glammy. And this is the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Make sure to go check out Marquita83's video. Love you guys. See you in the next one. Bye.